this is a fight for freedom. And in our generation, in our time, the fight is occurring in Ukraine. As the crisis grows in Ukraine, an outpouring of support from almost 5,000 miles away right here in Northeast Ohio. Hello, everybody, and thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Tracy Carlos. Hundreds gathered at the Ukrainian Orthodox Cathedral in Parma to rally in support of Ukrainians here and abroad. News 5's Clay Lepard now with the latest. Ukrainians are strong. A Sunday service packed shoulder to shoulder inside and out. With tensions high across the globe, hundreds congregated at the Ukrainian Orthodox Cathedral in Parma, united in their support for Ukraine. I think it just shows that people really do care. It's just to see like the overwhelming support is just like really empowering and it shows us that there really is hope. This marks the latest show of support in Northeast Ohio, where experts say there's anywhere from 30 to 40,000 Ukrainians. Uh, what's happening uh, is an atrocity. Among those in attendance, Ohio Senator Rob Portman, the co-chair of the Senate Ukraine Caucus, is set to return to Washington, D.C. Monday to meet with the Ukrainian ambassador to learn how else communities like these and governments can help. We have to be sure that we are responding as well, not just America, but countries all around the world who believe in freedom and believe that this is, this is the fight of our times. Support spilling into the streets to save the soul of a nation. That evil is taking away people's culture, people's identity, people's nationality. It can't stand it. This Russian Federation war was brought upon by only one man who is determined to invade and destroy our nation of Ukraine. Even before the call comes in, those here in Parma say they're looking at ways how they'll be able to help moving forward. We'll organize here in Northeast Ohio, so once uh, some of those uh, Ukrainian citizens may want to come to the United States, we'll be ready. In Parma. Clay Lepard, News 5.